Hey guys, Tightrip here, and today I'm going to be showing you a few settings that you can tweak that might help you get some more enjoyment out of the Company of Heroes 3 multiplayer tech test. So to get to the settings, you can come to here and then to settings, and we're going to be tweaking the graphics settings. So first off, clamp mouse to window. This is off by default. So if you have multiple monitors, when you try to like edge scroll, your mouse will go off the side of the screen. So you want to turn that on. VSync, I did some testing with VSync on and off. We know that VSync was pretty terrible in Company of Heroes 2, but I didn't notice much of a change on my system at least with it on or off. But I mean, let's just be safe. Let's just turn it off. Now, some people did mention that they had issues as they were scrolling around the map with it kind of feeling quite juddery. I've heard uh, two different solutions to this. You want to turn maybe the frame rate off to uncapped. Some people said that helped them. And other people said turning the texture detail down from high to medium really helped in that regard. So if you are having issues with, you know, the game quite juddery as you're scrolling around the map, I would suggest trying out those two settings. Now it's a pretty common topic of discussion in this game that the units are kind of blend into the backgrounds a bit. Maybe the lighting's not so good. Uh, and units, yeah, they just don't pop off the screen and maybe it varies quite a bit from map to map and sometimes perhaps the desert maps are the worst offenders from this but you can actually test a couple graphic settings in game in this regard unlike some of the others that we covered earlier in the video so a lot of these settings you can tweak in game so first off you might want to try setting the brightness down maybe from 50 where it starts try out 10 and uh, yeah I do think that that you know setting the brightness down does make a bit of a difference it does look a bit better, especially on some maps. Maybe not so necessary on like the night or dusk maps, but on the desert maps, I do feel like that helps out a bit. And also, uh, another setting you can change is anti-aliasing. Maybe try setting it off. Now, that may not come through on the video, but in-game, these uh, do look quite a bit sharper to me now. More defined edges uh, that make them pop off the background a bit better. So yeah, I'll try those two settings and as I say, you can easily do A-B testing in game yourself and you can tweak it from map to map as you desire. So try out those two settings and uh, maybe the game will look a bit better to you as well.